Look at that billet cover. That looks so good underneath. And Cody has a little surprise for him, and it is a poopy baby diaper. All right, first startup. Let's get it. Come on, battery. That's that E90. Basically whiskey. So after yesterday getting four transmissions done, Jack and Kevin are out of here. We got all the guys and it's time to put the trans in. So we got Todd. Oh wait. It's gotta adjust. There we go. We got Todd, Kevin, Cody, Brad, I don't know you. Ish. Oh, okay. Nice to meet you, bro. We got Ishmael and we got uh, Jack. So everyone here. Everyone had a part to play here, and it just went really smooth. So I just want to say thank you to everyone one last time before they leave. Thank you guys. And uh, yeah, it's time to get to racing. All right, so Trans is going back in, it looks like. I got Brad down there pumping it up. <laughs> so once the Trans is in, we actually, like I said yesterday, we have like four races set up for tonight already. So we're fixing my trans yesterday, or diff yesterday, throwing it back in the car today, racing like four other people on the street in Mexico, and then I'm driving straight home another 12, 14 hours. I get like one night's rest, and then I'm racing an import face-off on Sunday up in Washington to do some drag racing, so it's, uh, it's racing time. All right, so it's up on the lift. Oh man, I'm getting excited. My car is almost back. Thank you, Brad. <laughs> and he sacrificed his head. So nice. Let me see that head again. How bad is it now? Not bad. Oh, yeah. That's, that's getting better, at least. At least it didn't crack completely. I didn't cry, so. You're fine. <laughs> <laughs> we got my towel bitch over here. <laughs> no, it's just like Cody. <laughs> Right. All right, we got the transmission back in. Cody's stripping bolts, having a good time. Just gotta get the drive shaft. Oh, that wasn't me. All right, so Brad just finished. Well, Brad, Cody, and Ish just finished up. About 45. Whoa, whoa. About 45 minutes it took. We are all good to go. Just gotta put a couple things on. Look at that billet cover. That looks so good underneath. So now I got the billet and wave track in the rear with the DSS axles. So this stuff is just safe as can be. Fully built trans from Jack's transmissions. That's going to be fine. Front diff, Brad will be fixing and building in about a month. And then we're good to go. So yeah. Gotta go race. So what people forget about all the time is when you blow something like this up, Oil gets everywhere. <laughs> so he already like wiped down my entire under car and stuff that was covered, but getting the last few things, cleaning it up. Thank you, Brad. Yep. <laughs> All right, so we got my man Connor's, <laughs> Connor's car here, and Cody has a little surprise for him, and it is a poopy baby diaper. Going where? Ooh. Uh, like in the cargo storage in the back where it can get hit by the sun. <laughs> So yeah, that's gonna that's gonna heat up real nice and smell real good for you, Connor. I don't really know you, bro, but I'm sure you're gonna see this when they tell you. I hope you enjoyed that. <laughs> All right, so battery's completely dead, so we got to do this real quick. Here's one of the men I'm racing over there, and I think one of the other ones. <laughs> so we're just waiting right now. All right, first startup. Let's get it. Come on, battery. Yeah. Oh, I'm so excited to drive her. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> that thing is cold. 
Well, before we go racing, I've never packed my parachute, so these pros are gonna teach me. Watch this. I don't even know. So, pretty much all the strings have to be straight and untangled. <laughs> Uh, right? Alright, so I gotta fold all this up. Get it as tight as possible to fit inside of the mount. So we're missing the bag on this thing, making their job a lot harder right now. Oh, the spring goes on after? Yeah, because it yanks it out. Oh. I thought it pushed it out. No, it's so that spring goes after. It out. Just hold that up so it doesn't fall. Oh, at least 35. You guys go there a lot? Now the hard part it looks like. Yeah, and this is where it gets Virginia is better than the Oh, and then you gotta latch on top. I see. What the heck? Yeah. Let's just pop out. This thing's being a pain for you guys. Yeah. Thank you guys for doing this and showing me. This spring is so strong, it's ridiculous. Okay, grab that string on the bottom and wrap it up to the top one. Dang, pushing you backwards. Once we get this, it'll be easy. Just has to go through to hold it. Yeah, that's what. Hold it. Dang. There it is. <laughs> nice. So then how do you lock that string in? <laughs> well, for now, you're supposed to have your cable, which is right here. So that would go like that. Cable goes right inside, which is then what releases it. Yes, and then you pull this string out. Uh, but for now, I'll just grab a. So boom, there we go. That's the chute. And we're gonna put a pin in here for now, just to hold it. But I have a remove before flight that I have to put on right here, so that if I pull this on accident, this thing doesn't come out on the street or something. And Mike did not install this. <laughs> These wheels are going to give me no traction tonight. That's that E90. Basically whiskey. Ignite.
All right, guys, so we back at the shop. Uh, my man Brad, Cody, just helped me load up the trailer and stuff, so. That's, I mean, that's pretty much it. I'm not gonna show loading the car and all that. We got a lot of work to do so I can get out of here. It's like almost midnight right now, so. But it's just, like one. it's one right now? Yeah. Oh crap, and I got like a 15 hour drive home, so. <laughs> but yeah, we just went out some racing, so had a good time. Another big shout out to this guy right here, PPC, Brad, and Cody. If you guys have any needs for GTRs, I mean, pretty much GTRs, that's the guy. Let me know, I'll hook it all up. So, we had a good time, that was fun. We got the car running now, so we're good to go. His car's gonna be done soon, bigger turbos, bigger motor and everything, so. Yeah, thank you again, bro. Yep, no and uh, we'll see y'all tomorrow for some drag racing.